I'm here with a different type of video. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys, based on the request that you guys been asking me, how to upgrade your hard drive for your Xbox 360. I know this is pretty old, but people are still use 360 and they wanna upgrade their hard drive. The easiest way is to grab one of, or buy one of these cheap uh, external hard drive. Even if it's dead, just buy it, because we're not gonna use the drive inside. I'm gonna show you guys how to open this caddy but this is just an enclosure and replace it with your hard drive. You can just buy any SATA 2.5 inch hard drives and we're gonna place this hard drive right inside this one. So first thing first, you wanna grab your caddy or your external dead one or really old one. And you wanna grab yourself an opening tool. I'm using an iFixit tool set and I've been using a bit number T TR6. And what we're gonna do, at the bottom cover here, on bottom of this drive, you're gonna remove all these four screws. So three of them are visible. And one of them is covered by the warranty or by the Microsoft sticker. So remove that one. And the third, fourth one is right in here. You can actually make an insertion in the middle or just stick the screwdriver right in there and open it up and it will come out from there, okay? Next, that will be easy. Just go ahead and lift up this. Watch out for this spring right here. You might just release it. Wiggle it around a little bit. Just push it down. And pull it up. And grab the top cover and push it forward. So just like that this button is in my follow so just put it to one side and remember the position that you left it up put it right there now we're going to place it right here and we're going to change the screw bit to a little bigger one these are torque number tr10 so torque 10 and we're going to remove four screws right here Uh, four. Once you remove the four, we're just gonna pick up this uh, metal sheet right on top, and the drive is right in there. You can just go ahead and lift up a little bit and slide the drive out, and disconnect the SATA connector right there. And uh, you can remove this one. This one is a 20 gig one, 20 gig uh, Fujitsu. You can replace it with uh, any one terabyte Samsung, just stick it right in there with the same height and put the contact right in there. You can put up to two terabyte or whatever terabyte hard drive you want. It will work just fine. So you can put all the games that you want in there. And for this video, I'm not gonna actually do this. Because I need this disk for something else. I'm just going to go ahead and put back again the 20 gig. So pretty much it's the same thing. Put it in there. Make sure these holes right there matches the hole, holes right on the top. And grab the top cover here, the metal sheet. Put it on and put the screws right on the drive. And this is going to pull the drive upward. Now that we have this drive right, the screws right in there, the last thing would be grab this connector that you removed, place it right on top, grab the top cover, and make sure you bring it from the offset position. Let me see, it should go there, there, and bring it over, bring it over and then pull it backward a little bit, and that's it, and keep it down, push it down, Change your bed to T4, T8, and then place the bottom four screws. I hope you guys liked this video and it helped you guys out. If it did, click that thumbs up button. I'll really appreciate it if you guys subscribe. And if you have any requests or questions, you know where to leave them. And again, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in my next video.